Hey friends! Today I will be unboxing the newest addition to my Lord of the Rings collection, the Galadriel Dark Queen statue from What a Workshop. I pre-ordered the statue um, last August, and unfortunately because of the COVID crisis, um, the arrival date for the statue was pushed back to July. I was supposed to get it in May, but it's finally here, and that's what matters. She is safe. There is no issue, and I am so excited to finally open this up for you guys. I am so excited. Oh, I don't have a place to display her yet, but I wanted to unbox this anyways, just so I could get her out of the box and get her home where she rightfully belongs. Ready? Here we go. This is the box. It's massive, but you can see here, Gladriel Dark Queen statue. Huh. How am I gonna do this? Okay. Scissors. All right. Oh, he's stressed out. Okay. 16 pounds. 16 pounds. Okay. I'm just gonna open it like this. This is better. Let's see my hair. We have to be very careful with the precious. Oh! Oh! I broke the plastic. Oh my God, you guys. You guys, this is stunning. This box is absolutely stunning. Um, on the front here, you have the beautiful um, image of the statue that is inside. Uh, right here, Gladriel Dark Queen, uh, one six scale, absolutely stunning work on this. Beautiful artwork of Lothlorien on the back. You ready for this? Are you ready for this? I'm not ready. Oh, it's in pieces! So apparently they trust me to put this thing together. <laughs> Luckily they have a really nice sheet here of how to put it all together. What am I fuck it up? What? What happens if I fuck this shit up? I'm gonna set this, I'm gonna set this down and then I'll pull it out, let, you know. Even the styrofoam is printed. Look at this emboss. Look at this. We're gonna, we're gonna try, we're gonna try it like this. Maybe it works. It's okay. It's all right. Oh, I hope I opened this right. What was that? Oh my god, you guys! As you can kind of see, this is what it looks like. I'm getting stressed out, I'm getting stressed out. We're gonna, tr we're gonna, We try to figure this out. It'll be good. Okay, so every piece is numbered on this, which is good. Thank you for being very proactive and making sure I know how to put the thing together and I don't put her arm where her head goes. Thank you, Weta. Thank you. Let's start with the base. All right. All Can you guys see this? Okay, wait. Look at how stunning just this is. This is beautiful. All of that pearlescent detail on there, beautiful. So this is two, one, two. Look at that face. Look at that face. Four is the arm.
so I want to take a break and show you guys what I'm doing. So this is one of the pieces. These are just the extra uh, fabric tendrils that are kind of billowing in her almighty uh, terrifyingness. So I'm just sticking these kind of where they're going. This thing is absolutely beautiful. All the detail that goes into it, the metal armor, the extra pieces, just how they airbrushed everything to make it look like it's actual fabric is beautiful. I just absolutely beautiful. I'm not I'm kind of speechless. I'm like, my favorite detail, I think, though, has to be her hair. Like, just how see-through and transparent the ends look to make it look like they're really fine and just the amount of life the statue has is breathtaking. This is my first statue from What A Workshop and I will definitely be purchasing or looking out for more because the amount of detail and the time that they took to put this together, yeah, totally, like, hands down worth it. Best investment I've ever made for my collection. Um, the number on this one is, let's see here, 157. It also has the signature of the sculptor, um, Brigitte, who did an amazing, amazing job on this. Like, well done. Apparently she also did the um, one fourth scale bust of Gladriel, and I mean, just, I mean, just keep making Gladriel statues because literally I will buy all of them. How many of you got? Because I will buy them. You want to make a life-size Gladriel? I'm here for it. I'm here for it. It's an absolutely gorgeous, gorgeous addition to the Lord of the Rings collection. Um, if you have been wanting to purchase from Weta and saw some of the statues and you thought that you've always wanted one, get one. They're totally worth it. Um, Amazing, literally amazing. Hope everyone is staying safe during this quarantining process, during this craziness. Thank you for watching this unboxing video, and until next time, you can find me in Lothlorien. Bye.